Okay then, welcome back to Let's Play GTA Vice City with the Nightmare mod. So, whoa, go away you crazy bitch. It's getting a bit hairy out here right now. Yeah, hairy. Auntie Mary had a canary up the leg of her drawer. She sat on the grass, she burned her ass, and that was the end of the war. Okay, next up is Death Row for Kempo. Now, I was going to say, I recently ran into a potential flaw with this mod, but fortunately I've uh, tested out said flaw, and I think it only happens if you um, if you turn on this mod during um, a game that you've already started, and not a game that you've started from the beginning, basically. Hold on a minute. Yeah, basically I think it only affects a game in progress. But if you start a brand new game from scratch with the mod already on, you'll be fine. The problem is... I'll tell you. Just a minute. Let's get going. Right. I found that um, when I load a save, like say in uh, Starfish Island or um, Downtown, or anywhere else apart from Ocean Beach or the Ocean View Hotel, I found that the pedestrians weren't rioting anymore for some reason. But luckily I've just tested it on this particular save and it all seems to be okay. I mean, I loaded up this save right here and I went across the downtown, saved there and, um, and then reloaded that save and the pedestrians were still rising, so it's all good. So again, I think it only affects a game that's already in progress. So if you want to get the uh, full experience of this mod, you want to start a brand new game from scratch, and not activate this mod in a game in progress, okay? This mission should be too hard as long as I keep my distance and as long as Lance doesn't bitch about, I'm happy. Okay. Now then. I haven't got a sniper rifle. Uh, there's no path through here, is there? No, sadly. Right, hold on a minute. I'm gonna take these guys on without getting torn to pieces. I'll quickly run through here, I might be okay. Emphasis on might! <laughs> Just made it, little bastards. Right. I haven't got an assault rifle anymore, and it's... It's because when you use uh, the Kruger in uh, the previous mission, Supply and Demand, if you had any kind of assault rifle, it'll disappear after that mission is completed. Take that. Take the Ruger. Kruger, whatever. Got all that money. Why do bakers never get poor? They've always got lots of dough. Um, just uh, keeping my eye on Lance's health bar. As well as uh, looking around the corner so anyone who wants to jump out at me. Such as those two dickheads right there. Jesus, well done. Yeah, that was the guy that gunned me down when I was unable to shoot suddenly in my uh, Chaos Percent playthrough. So don't shoot Lance, please. My one shot is all it takes to kill these cunts. There's still one guy left. Oh yeah, him. Did that hurt? Good. There goes my careful <clears throat> blown to shit. Thanks to you. You screwed up real good, Lance. You killed my brother. What do you expect me to do? Mow his lawns? We're gonna have to take out that prick Diaz before he takes us out. You okay to use a gun? Sure. I guess. Nice to see you too. Let's get out of here. Yeah, go out there and mow his lawns, Lance. It'll be better than you sitting around in your arse all day having a drink. While, um, 
one of our bars doesn't want to pay protection. And you call that handling it. Twit. Now then, the mission's not over yet. I don't know where my bike... Well, I can hear my bike. But I'm not going to get it. Because I just got rammed to pieces by those uh, dickheads in the comets. So we'll take this way. Watch out for those comets. Any minute now they'll be coming. I didn't know cars could have orgasms. That's quite enough of that. Well, they're nowhere to be seen, so it's all good. Just keep driving, just keep driving. This is GTA, not Finding Nemo. Finding Lance. Quite frequently in the GTA series, I must say. On the Hitman series, Finding Agent Smith. Agent Shit. Here we are. Get patched up and meet me on the bridge to Star Island, okay? Okay, I got you. Lance, it's not a good idea to walk into a hospital with a fucking gun in your hand. Okay. <clears throat> I don't know if I should save or not. Uh, I'll go by uh, Scumhole Shack in downtown, just in case. Because I can't be bothered going all the way to Ocean View and then all the way back to Starfish Island. I'll take the phone call from uh, the Colonel first. I believe in the later versions of Vice City, the line, I hate the damn French, has been taken out. Tommy, Tomas, it's Cortez. Look, the French are giving me all kinds of trouble, amigo. Them hypocrites. They spend a hundred years stealing from poor countries, and they call me a thief. Huh? <laughs> I'm going to need your help as soon as possible, amigo. So please hurry. Huh? Tommy, I need you, alright? I hated them French. Yep, that last line was cut out from uh, the later versions of the game. So I can get some more ammo for this. Albeit not much. So we'll buy uh, the safe house here just for 1k. Ah, itchy ear syndrome again. So it was here where I, uh, yeah, I saved today just to test that potential flaw that I mentioned where the pedestrians were no longer writing. See if I can get this bastard's freeway. Angel, sorry, no, I can't. No, I can't. Right, off to Starship. Uh, Starship Troopers, yeah, off to Starship Troopers we must go. Off to Starfish Island, sorry. For rub out. Just like Death Row, rub out shouldn't be too hard as long as I take my time. As long as Lance doesn't be a dick. Shakedown could be quite tricky because um, the cops and security guards in the mall all have M60s this time around. Bar Brawl should be a walk in the park, as long as I keep my distance from the guards at DBP security. Copland could be tricky as well, as long as I'm fast and get out of the mall as quickly as I can, because the cops in that mission have M4s, remember? And then after that, it's a case of, uh, it's a matter of deciding which, uh, which, uh, asset properties to buy. Distribution at the Cherry Popper Ice Cream Fancy would be a pain in the arse. This place is going to be falling with assholes, be careful. Don't worry, Tommy, I'm coming! Aha, they're distracted by killing each other. This is going to make the mission a hell of a lot easier. As long as Lance doesn't bitch about. Or dick about, whatever. A little fun fact for you. I've done a base cover of uh, ACDC's War Machine over on my Quiet Basis channel. And, um. She's shooting her. I only wanted to uh, do that song simply because somebody at my work said I don't want to be dicking about. And that song actually contains the lyric. Yeah, actually contains the lyric you've been kicking around, but it sounds like dicking around to me. Right in the shin, or the foot, whatever. 
Shot in the foot, literally. Is he dead? Still very much alive. I can't get him. Okay, I can't now. So that's the f ground floor. Second, oh Jesus, second floor coming right up. This DR's not looking forward to. He's got a big ass MP5. Lance quite often gets killed there. Fucking microphone keeps slipping down my face again. This gun's a fucking beast. I think the rest of the guys are on the ground floor, apart from him. Use the M4 for Diaz. Here he comes. Diaz! I've come to take over your business! Tommy! You betrayed me, you idiot! I'm gonna kill you real soon! I'm so glad I knocked Lance down there. <laughs> because Diaz would have shot him to pieces. So I found that the enemies in this game only shoot at you when you're on your feet. If you get knocked down, they give you a chance, which is very nice, in my opinion. There we go. Very good. Very good indeed. Listen to that shit. So let's uh, save here. Next up, Shakedown, which, as I said, could be very tricky. Shut up, Ken. I forgot his name there. <laughs> Tell me, I've got a better idea. I'm going to reload my save just to make sure that the problem I mentioned is not occurring. So I'm just going to sneak past the pink marker, go outside. Well, it sounds like the ri rioting pedestrians is still switched on. Judging by that shit. Jesus fucking Christ, guys. No pedestrians. Because there should be. Shut up, phone, I can hear you. The whole fucking universe can hear you. Yeah. It's all good, they're still rioting. Okay, fine, I'll take it. Good, good. I rest my case. The problem only affects your game if it's a game in progress and not not a game that you've uh, to start from scratch. Okay. Here we go. Off to the North Point Mall, or the Vice Point Mall as it's called in Vice City Stories. So again, the cops and the security in this mission have M60s now, because under normal circumstances they have uh, <coughs> pistols. So yeah, after a completed cop plant, I need to decide which uh, asset missions to do. I probably won't do distribution for the ice cream factory because the pedestrians will just constantly yank me out of the ice cream van. And you have to do 50 transactions in one sitting. So you can't do 48 in one sitting and then do 2 in another sitting. It won't count. I'll do checkpoint Charlie for the boatyard, that's piss easy. Especially now that I've uh, turned the uh, boat collision damage off after that shit that happened in supply and demand. Supply and dickmand. I'm not doing the Malibu Club, simply because of the driver mission, which is the game's hardest mission. Now then, start with uh, the Tar Brush Cafe. My livelihood destroyed! Arsetti, remember the name! Answers in the comments, please. Do you fail the mission if any of the shopkeepers get killed? I have no idea. Who's that cop? I hear a cop. I'm gonna grab that. Close pick up just in case. Yeah. Not that I'll need it though, because I'll get. I want to level right back. You're a whore. You're a fucking whore. 
And wear your whore makeup, you whore. Auntie Mary had a canary. She walked right into the door. She's got chocolate mousse covered on her boobs. No, she got her boobs covered in chocolate mousse, and then she's a fucking whore. What the fuck ever? That is fucking terrible. Oh shitaki fucking mushrooms. I am getting my arse handed to me now. Oh, oh fucking hell. You are an arsehole. I knew that was going to happen. Right. Shut up, Ken. I remembered your name that time. You gotta listen to this one, man. I was about to say, you're not going to sh shoot each other. Yes, they are. I'll see in Vice Point. I don't know what's up with the mic today. Now then. It's the best course of action to take here. Ruin. Ruin. So there's health in there. I'm paid for the air for protection. I run this town now. Me. I should see if I can uh, quickly buy some armor from uh, ammunition during this mission. Because the mall does contain an ammunition. One, Tommy. My beautiful window display. Get over it. Who said that? Him. I don't think so, mate. Too far away. At least all the windows on this side now. So. I can dock as well. Quack. Damn it. I was only hitting the wall. No one around this corner. Good. Keep it that way. Damn it. Go and reload this fucking thing, Tommy. That's it. There you go. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. Let's go. You can skip that, right? Yeah, you can. I got him, I got him. You've got no one, mate. I got you, babe. Does not come into it. Oh, I've got a shitload of phone calls to take now. Fucking hell. Let's get the fuck out of here.